Happy weekend, folks. Uh, just a little update for what's going on. Uh, I don't have a long video for today, uh, but as you can see behind me, I've, we've been kind of working busily. Uh, we have a lot of stuff going on over this next week or so. So we're trying to get a lot of things done. Uh, one of the things I have going on right now is uh, working on a, um, a coop or a chicken tractor um, for our younger birds uh, as we're working on cleaning up the actual chicken coop moving things around uh, you can see right here i'll flip around real quick you can see right here the uh the babies are quickly running out of room in the portable pens uh, we still migrate them back and forth and then also uh over here you can see the turkeys are in the same predicament and they could use a little bit of extra room run to run around in so we've been working on building a A-frame chicken tractor. Uh, hopefully I'll pull in some video of that, uh, maybe see some of the comedy of what's going on behind the scenes. I'm building this guy. Um, but just eight by six area. This will be for kind of our, our brooding tractor, probably uh, in the long run for the turkeys. Gonna have a sheltered area in the back and then um, uh, just hardware cloth up the sides door on the end so that we can get in and out as needed um, this has been kind of the weekend project along with cleaning everything up and uh, other than that we've been working on uh, various things we've been, still been chopping wood um, here's some of the bundle yeah we're still doing the wood so if you're all looking for uh, firewood for for the uh, for the fall season hey we got that uh hit us up um, i'll try and uh remember to drop a link to the post on facebook that we had about it um but we're, we're gonna have uh firewood come in pretty much all season long so that's uh, that's another thing um that we've been working on uh you probably saw the video the juniors are now officially laying eggs um they've started they're still really small um, that happens when when uh, hens start laying at first um, they will get bigger over time so we're still not selling eggs um, we only have a couple of them that are laying but uh, um, hopefully in the next couple of weeks or so we'll get more laying and then uh, the eggs will also start getting bigger to their normal size which you guys are used to the bigger um, uh, kind of grade a extra large size eggs um, here's here's a Here's the juniors. They're they're hiding in the shade back there because we're in afternoon sun right now. There's Alan enjoying some food. But we're hoping to be able to get uh, everything cleaned up here in the chicken coop over the next week or so. Um, well, probably two weeks. Get it all cleaned up, sanitized out. I've already gone through, started sanitizing um, last week. Did a full spray down. Um, we're we're cleaning removing some of the older stuff and um, we'll be running another run of sanit uh, sanitizer through there uh, just kind of getting everything sterilized out hopefully cleaned up and then juniors will be moving in there um, either hopefully by the end of the month uh, it's been a slow process and then um, I know I posted the video uh, a week or so back on the loofahs they're still growing like crazy um, I, I'm actually getting to the point where I am harvesting some. Here, uh, let me flip this. And I don't know if you can see this over here very well, but this guy right up in the corner, you can see how that's, it's still yellow, but it's, it's starting to brown up. This is what I'm looking for from uh, across most of it. So this one will be ready to harvest in like another mm, day or two. But I still do have a lot of fresh loofahs. You can see off in the, the background over there. Let me zoom in a little bit. You can see them. Um, the vines have just been, just keep on going. Um, they've climbed up the compost pile and we got fresh loofahs starting over there. Uh, so we'll be in uh, dealing with a lot of loofahs over the next month or two. And then uh, the other thing is I'll walk over here. Uh, this weekend I was really desperately trying to get time in to... Uh, work on the pig pen for the boars um, I have been talking to our breeder we're trying to get 
a good idea of what kind of space I need initially for them. Um, I don't know exactly how big they are at this current point in time. But uh, yeah, um, I've been really excited. This The fence, the, the front half of the fence is, is up. So I just need to drop some T-post. Um, the, the big problem that I have is I need some more hog panels and uh, I just don't have the, the right vehicle to be able to bring those home. Those are 16 foot long and they won't fit in the flex. Um, and I don't have a trailer hitch either. So, uh, But this up here, right up here at the end of the chicken run, this, this area right in here, um, we're going to be dropping some T-posts in and, and setting up a pen, kind of like what we did for the for the girls when we first started out. So those are our plans. Not a whole heck of a lot going on. Uh, yeah, we've just been enjoying the, the cooler weather a little bit. Still been really hot out here. We've been in the 80s. Uh, the veggie garden's still growing pretty well. I actually got another full round uh, uh, banana peppers. Uh, they're they're just uh, they're they're going nuts. We got the rain. They all blossomed up, and we got peppers. We, I mean, you can see right here we have little ones <laughs> growing. Uh, so we'll be harvesting these uh, this week and hopefully getting them canned up. You can see the peas growing in the background here. And then we got the bell peppers over here. I know I went over this last the last video too, but you can see all the lettuce starting to crop up in here. Um, so yeah. Pretty much as always, we got a million things going on. Um, just trying to keep our heads on straight and get all this stuff done. Um, we'll be uh, a little behind the eight ball here as, as weather starts getting cooler and we start uh, trying to winterize things. And um, we're just gonna, our days are a lot shorter now. I'm running out of time in the day to get things done before it gets dark. So starting to have to pick and choose and uh, keep going from there but this is what we're up to um, like I said not not a really fun uh, video today but we got a, a lot going on and just trying to keep our heads above water while we make our way through every day so as always you know if you like what we do hit that subscribe button uh, oh yeah speaking of one last thing we are trying to make 100 subscribers. Uh, we got a long ways to go. Um, at last count in this video, we had like around 25. If we make 100 subscribers, I have no real time frame on this, but if we make it, let's say by the end of the year, I'll do a video of us celebrating and our celebration is gonna be party hats on the animals. You want to see a party hat on a pig? You want to see a party hat on a cow? You want to see a party hat on a goat? Yeah, we'll do that. I'm going to do party hats because we're going to celebrate if we hit 100 subscribers. Um, it'll be really exciting for us. We're hoping we're going to get there. Um, uh, if, if you've been catching up on our, our Facebook posts, um, I did kind of put out a, a plea on there because of everything that's been going on with COVID and everything. We're really trying to, to get these videos as, as uh, part of what we provide to you. We love doing it. Um, so uh, if, if you want to support us in that, hit that subscribe button. And like I said, I, I know it sounds like a gimmick, but I, I was like, it would be so funny to do something like that um, just for our own, our own amusement. Not only that, but your amusement too. Um, I really want to see Maya in a party hat. Uh, she'd probably hate me for it, but... Uh, yeah, I'll, we'll get that on video. And uh, like I said, 100 subscribers. Once we get there, I'll do a video on party hats. I don't care when it is. We'll just do it um, and, and see if we can uh, have some fun with it. All right, we're going to sign off. Um, hit that subscribe button. Like the post. Feel free to give us some comments. Hit us up on Facebook, email, Messenger, uh, Instagram, etc., etc., etc. But we hope to see you. Uh, we hope you like what we're doing, and we'll catch you later.